Hello and welcome to another Blender tutorial by the Blender Animations. In this tutorial I'm going to show you how to use Armature. Now Armature is what you'll use to create a skeleton uh, which will enable you to control your object. Um, so for this example we're going to use the default cube and we're going to scale it out on the x-axis with S and X just to make it a little bit longer so that you'll be able to control it easier. Then I'm going to put two ring cuts in it with Control R and scroll forward once. And now I'm going to add my armature. So I'm going to add it on the left hand side. So space and press add armature. And then it will appear there. So press tab to enter edit mode of the armature. And then you've selected this little handle here. Just there, which is the smaller end. So if you're going to extrude off armature, you always extrude off the smaller end. I'm just going to use G and I'm going to drag this to the x-axis, sorry the z-axis there, and I'm going to extrude off it with E, take it out to the other side of the box. Okay, so now we have our armature inside our box, <coughs> and we're ready to assign the mesh to the armature. So when you're assigning armature to mesh, you always select the object first, then hold shift, then select the mesh, um, the armature press Control P and it's going to say make parent 2 and you're going to select armature and create from bone heat okay so now the armature is assigned to this mesh so if you select the armature with the right mouse click go into ob change from object mode to pose mode then you can rotate um, your armature and it will be controlling your mesh Okay, so that's how to set up a basic armature. Um, so the step from here would be to go to weight painting in um, your object. So when you're in pose mode in the armature, if you right mouse click on your object and press control tab, you go into weight painting, which um, it just shows where all the control is. Because um, the if it's red, then it's complete control from the armature, but if it's blue, there's no control. Um, so because it's red here, if you rotate this, it will only move the areas that are red, whereas the areas that are blue will stay behind. Um, and then you will set the weight in here under this paint panel, and just put it on the vertices you want. And see now there's less control in that area. <coughs> okay, thank you for watching. If you have any more questions, or comments, please feel free to send me a personal message or leave me a comment. Thanks, have a good day.